What is an angle? If you have two straight arms that meet at a corner point or vertex, the angle is the amount of turn between the arms. Angles are measured in degrees. A turn of one full rotation or circle is 360 degrees. A turn of half a circle is 180 degrees. And a turn of a quarter of a circle is 90 degrees. Angles can be classified by the amount of turn between the arms. An angle that measures less than 90 degrees is called an acute angle. An angle that measures exactly 90 degrees is called a right angle. An angle that is greater than 90 degrees but less than 180 degrees is called an obtuse angle. An angle that measures exactly 180 degrees is called a straight angle. An angle that is greater than 180 degrees but less than 360 degrees is called a reflex angle. And an angle that measures exactly 360 degrees is called a full rotation. If you have a shape with corners or vertices A, B, C and D an angle can be labelled by giving three letters where the middle letter is the vertex where the angle occurs. So C, D, B is this angle and A, C, D is this angle. Here are some interesting facts about angles. Angles on a straight line always add up to 180 degrees because together they make a straight angle. Here the straight angle has been split into two. If you know one angle you can always work out the other one because A plus B equals 180 degrees. In this example A equals 50 degrees. So B equals 180 minus 50 which equals 130 degrees. Similarly angles around a point always add up to 360 degrees because together they make a full rotation. Here there are four angles around a point. If you know three of the angles, you can work out the other one because A plus B plus C plus D equals 360 degrees. In this example, A equals 30 degrees, B equals 70 degrees and C equals 60 degrees. So D equals 360 minus 30 plus 70 plus 60 which is the same as 360 minus 160 or 200 degrees.